Have you tried many different methods? For example, if you attended many lessons or you look at some YouTube videos, right? The lines that are being drawn are usually very pretty, very easy to trade and usually profitable. But when you try to draw these lines, like for example, trend lines or horizontal lines, it just doesn't work. The trade that you did fail and you lose money. In this video, I'd like to share with you two things, two things which are easy that can help you with this problem. That means the lines that you've drawn, they are and can be very profitable. Have you clicked the subscribe button? And how about a like? The first tip in order to draw your lines properly is to identify the current price structure and to know that the structure had been broken. Now let's take a look at this place here. So this is obviously an upward movement. In an upward movement, the structure is determined by price making a higher high versus the previous high and price making a higher low versus the previous low. So this is the price structure. Now, in order to make sure the lines that you draw in, they are correct, you have to ensure that each of the high or low properly broken. So what do I mean by this? Let's say, for example, I know that around here, the price had a close below the previous low. So it seems that the current upward movement is broken because there was a close below the previous low. But different instrument needs to handle different time period close. Now, for example, if you are trading into Forex, I would recommend that you determine the break of a structure upon a day close. That means to wait for minimum a day to close below a price low to confirm that the structure had been broken. So for example, if you are doing stocks in the same context, you want to ensure that that it's a weak close below the previous low to show that the structure had been properly broken. So once the structure is broken, then you'll be able to draw in a horizontal line based on the break of the structure. Likewise, for example here, so this was a downward movement here given by a high and a low and a lower high and a lower low. You want to assume that price is going to break out of this structure to change into a new price structure, then we want want to ensure that the previous high had been broken. So for Forex, look for a day closed above the previous high and for stocks, right, look for a week close above the previous high. So this is what I mean by a break of the structure. You need to have a clean break when the structure is broken in order to draw in your lines. Now let's take a look in this price chart here, which is S&P 500 that I just traded. There was a break of this upward price structure here. What do I mean by this, right? For example, price make a higher high. So this is a higher high. And at this point of time, if you compare to the previous low, then this could be still about the same low or it's just a higher low, isn't it? So we aren't and we are not able to confirm that there was a price structure broken until we see price movement around here. When you see price movement around here, you know that probably a price structure had been broken already because there was a day close that closed below the low of this structure low. What I like to do is I like to draw in a horizontal line like this, but this doesn't ensure that your line would be tradable and profitable. The second tip, which is to ensure that your line is tradable and profitable, is to look for a valid reaction on that line. For example, in this case here, the strategy is to sell when price retrace back towards the line. But don't forget, in the market, they use different lines. For example, some use trend lines, some use Fibonacci, some use horizontal line, some use any form of different method out there. It doesn't mean that when you use a horizontal line, it would be correct. For example, let's take a look at what happened. Happen, right so we have price moving you know below the structure low here and of course you assume that price might retest into this horizontal line that we have drawn and then you'll be looking for a sell but don't forget that the market is out there and it's going to make things difficult for you sometimes it will just treat as if that it broke upwards and then this seems to be like a fake break okay but if you consider the fact that there could be other lines that's being drawn by the market then you might have detected that you can draw in like a trend line that's based on a closing price okay 
or you might be able to draw in another horizontal line that's based on the uh, you know closing price or you might be able to draw in for example the Fibonacci retracement let me just draw that for you so there are different ways that you want to draw all right for example price might react to this you know 62 uh, percent in terms of reaction the second tip here is to look for reactions amongst those lines that you've drawn that means you shouldn't be assumed that the lines that you've drawn in they are valid you should assume that there are different types of lines that the market is looking at and you just want to find that correct reaction because price had already broken out of a previous low you want to trade when price retrace upward and that upward is a retracement trade but you just doesn't know that where is that exact moment you should pull the trigger because if you had already put in here and if price continue to move up then you might have a bit of a losses and and you might be stop out so the key idea here is to draw in as many possible combinations of lines that you might have or the market might be using for example i've drawn in two sets of horizontal lines and a trend line and i'll be basically waiting for a reaction what are reactions i'm looking at i'm actually looking at a wash and rinse that means a bearish wash and rinse reaction if you want to find out how i use wash and rinse remember to refer to this video here that I did a very extensive tutorial on how I use wash and means to look for that as that trigger so in this case you know price uh, moves out and we have an uh, like a bit of a red color thick here so that's confirmed the wash and rinse happen and by trading upon when there is a reaction you wouldn't be easily stop out because you see that i traded when there was reaction i knew that the stop loss would be somewhere around here and see what happened price actually moves down you don't be misled that price is actually heading up because you know if you draw in all these possible combinations of a lines your conclusion would be it is still being resisted let me just sum up with what i've just said in the tutorial just now so to draw in a valid or rather a profitable lines whether it's trend line or horizontal line always wait for the price structure to be broken and different instrument would requires you to focus on different time frame for example for me when i use wash and means for forex i always use a day confirmation to ensure that the structure has been broken for stocks for wash and means i will use a week time frame for confirmation of the break of that structure second is to draw in combinations of lines don't just rely on one set of lines you draw in combination of lines whether these are horizontal lines these are fibonacci these are pivots or these are trend lines then wait for reaction market reaction will tell you that this is the valid set of lines that they are looking at and hopefully with this two tips you can increase the probability of you getting the right set of lines and the right levels for you to trade if you like the video remember to subscribe and to have a like for this video and scan this qr code to receive my latest update on the trades that i'm doing thanks for watching and i see you in my next video these are trades which are done by myself or my students using the alien wall strategy join our community and take advantage of our six times a week training lessons automated trade signals and live trading sessions with our experienced alien traders and for a limited time we are offering a hundred percent full cashback offer on our course fee that's right you can learn our strategy risk-free over 1,000 students have already taken advantage of this offer and seen success. Visit this website now to learn more and join our community.